Hi everyone, welcome to the Random Home Gadgets channel. In today's video, I will show you how to perform a routine annual maintenance for your tankless water heater, including descaling, cleaning the air intake filter, and cleaning the water intake filter. Here are the equipments that you need. A submersible sump pump, two washer hose, a container that can hold at least 5 gallons, a Phillips screwdriver, a prior, and 2 gallons of white vinegar. Step 1. Turn off the water heater. In this Renai water heater, you may push the off button on the control panel or you can unplug it. Step 2. Cleaning the air intake filter. Remove the side plastic covers that conceals the screws. Remove the four screws. Tilt the front cover forward from the bottom, then release it by pushing up. You may find the air intake filter located at the top of the water heater. Pull it out to clean off any debris. Put the filter back in. Step 3. Discaling. Check the water pipes and valves. Make sure you have the main water valves and the bypass valves. If you don't have the bypass valves, stop and call your plumbers to install them. The general rule for the valve is that when it's parallel to the pipe, it's open. When it's perpendicular to the pipe, it's closed. Also, the color coding for the valves are blue means cold water going into the water heater. Red means hot water going out from the water heater. First, close the main intake and outflow valves. This isolates the heater from the house water circuit. Open the protective caps for the bypass valves and connect the water hose. Put the other end of the water hose in the container. Put the sump pump in the container. Connect the blue hose to the sump pump. This way, the pump will pump the cleaning solution out via the blue hose and go into the heater, then comes out via the red hose back to the container. Put 2 gallons of white vinegar into the container. Open the bypass valves. Puck in the sump pump. Now you are flushing the vinegar into the heater to descaling. Let the flush going for about 45 minutes to an hour.
Once the flushing is done, unplug the sump pump. Close the blue bypass valve and open the blue main water valve. This way, fresh water will flush through the heater to clean up the residual vinegar. Do this for about 2 minutes. Close the red bypass valve. Close the blue main valve. Step 4. Cleaning the water intake filter. The water intake filter locates just above the main water valve. It's usually quite tight and need a prior to unscrew it. Check and clean the debris. Pull it back. Use the prior to tighten it. Open back the blue and the red main valves. Now the heater is connected back to the house water. Step 5. Check the flame. Turn the water heater back on. You may see the flame through this peephole. It should be blue when it's working properly. If the color is not blue, Call your plumber to troubleshoot. Once everything is checked, turn off the heater again and put the front cover back. At the end, I would also recommend cleaning the sump pump by circulating fresh water for about a minute to clean out any residual vinegar in the pump. And also clean the hoses so you can keep them in good condition to be used next year. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please write them down in the comment section below. See you next time!